Hey, what is up guys? It is Tempa Cookies here today, and I'm going to be teaching you guys how to jailbreak iOS 8.1.3 all the way to iOS 8.4. So if you have a software that's anywhere in between those iOS versions, you are good to go and you can jailbreak. So there are a couple things you will need for this video. First is iTunes, second is WinRAR, and obviously the third one would be the Taiji jailbreak file. Now, Pangu is actually not doing it for iOS 8. They might be doing it for iOS 9. There is a big possibility. But uh, so far, Taiji has taken over iOS uh, 8 jailbreaking, and uh, they're the one that's providing us with the jailbreak tool. So what you want to do, if you're already jailbroken on iOS 8.3 or 8.1.3 or 8.2, you want to go into iTunes. You want to make a backup. That's obviously if anything goes wrong, you're going to have a backup. Then you want to restore your iPhone. You don't need to put into DFU or anything, just restore it. And uh, then it's going to ask you to upgrade to 8.4. Do that. Once you are done, you want to go and go to Google. And uh, I downloaded WinRare, so this is the link for WinRare. Uh, I will leave it in the description below. It's free uh, from SoftSonic. Second, what you want to do is go either taiji.com slash en for English and download the uh, file, the jailbreak tool from there. Um, for me, I, it was actually much slower, so I'm going to show you guys where I got it from. So I'm just going to scroll down, and as I'm making this video, the current version is 2.2.0. I'm just going to click download, and then it's going to download the zip file here. Now, another uh, mirror you can actually get it from. I'm going to put both of these in the description below. Go here. And it's actually by Mega. Um, I really like Mega because their download speeds are really quick. So I use it all the time from there. Um, you click download to your computer. And yeah, see, it's, it's pretty fast. It only takes like less than a minute. So once you have all of these WinRAR, the tool, you want to go and open up WinRAR. It's going to uh, be under Taiji Jailbreak. Taiji Break. Uh, English two thousand two points. There's no dots there, obviously, but it's gonna be two thousand two hundred zip file. You wanna double click it, and you wanna go to the application and drag it to the desktop. The reason I actually use WinRAR for this is because it's actually much quicker than just you know using like standard Windows zip transfers, and you know it has to unpack it and make an exe file. Um, so once you have that, you want to right click it and run as an administrator and make sure that your Find My iPhone is off. Uh, make sure Find My iPhone is off and make sure that um, your passcode is off as well. So once you have both of those off, you can proceed. Now, if the jailbreak does not work for the first time, um, reset your phone all over again turn off Wi-Fi and then try it one more time so what you want to do is you want to unlock your phone go into settings you want to scroll down to general and auto lock and you want to turn off uh, you want to make sure auto lock is on never now once just leave your phone on on the home screen you want to uncheck 3k assistant and uh, once you've done all the steps, you just want to click start. And I'm just going to stay here with the process with you. So it's going to start and um, restart your device at 20%. That's probably when it's going to take the longest. 20% and 60% and 90%. That's when it takes the longest. So just wait patiently. Do not unplug your device. Do not touch it. And um, yeah. So I'm just going to wait here and I'll get back when it's done. I'm just going to leave it on so you guys can see the process.
making my mistake guys so okay so we did that for you guys now you guys can check that out but it's a success close out iTunes here and uh yeah so guys if you are stuck like me at 20% just leave it it um let, let it reboot one more time um I slid and I unlocked I did the slide to unlock and I unlocked my iPhone to the home screen that's probably why so just do not touch your iPhone at all if you get the storage almost full just leave it wait till it goes to 99% and yeah that's all I'm gonna cut out the 20% part so you guys don't have to see that. Alright, guys, as you can see, we are at 99%, so it is restarting our device once more. Um, we have to just wait for it. So, again, guys, as you can see, it says jailbreak succeeded. Just click close. Wait for your device to boot up. Once it boots up and it's on the lock screen, you can un or disconnect your device. Now, if you were stuck like me, I was actually stuck at 20%, but um, you won't see that in the jailbreak. I'm going to remove that clip. But uh, if you're stuck at 20% and it says data processing and it doesn't work, just wait. And uh, it'll, it should restart your device once more and then it'll go through. So right now, uh, I just unplugged my device. And I'm gonna you have to go into Cydia and it's gonna prepare the file system. So just wait for that. It's gonna say preparing file system. And then Cydia will exit when complete. So yeah. Um, I'm just gonna wait for that and then I'll come back when it's done. So I'm just gonna leave it on so just you guys can know how long approximately it takes. Whatever you do guys. Um do not press the home button. Or try to close out of it because that can cause big problems and you will have to reset your phone all over again and then you have to re jailbreak it. So uh, all in all, just do not exit out. Just let Cydia do its thing. Let it prepare its file system. Once it, it is done, it's gonna exit and uh, I don't and it's gonna do a respring on the device. It's not gonna be a reboot. Uh, it should be a respring. Uh, we'll see in a second here. So all right, guys. So. Uh, the file system on city just finished and I believe it is doing a respring. Let's tell you guys in one second. Okay, so it did, did a respring. It did a respring. I'm just gonna slide to unlock my phone once more. You guys can just go back and open city. I'm sorry I don't have an external camera so you guys can like see what's going on here. But I'm trying to walk you guys step by step uh, as best as I can. So just wait for all the sources to like refresh and everything. And you'll see if there are any required changes, which, as you can see, I have a link identity editor there. So I'm just going to upgrade that. And, uh, yeah, you guys shouldn't have anything else. You shouldn't run into any problems. Like I said, if you do run into problems during a jailbreak, like you get stuck on 20%, just wait, let it reboot. Do not slide to unlock because that can cause problems. Or just try turning off your Wi-Fi, reset your phone, turn off your Wi-Fi, and try jailbreaking once more. So guys, thank you guys for watching my video on how to jailbreak from iOS 8.1.3 to iOS 8.4. I will leave all the links down in the description below. Um, please subscribe for some awesome iPhone videos and things like that. And uh, yeah, leave a like. Tamil Cookies out.